Hidalgo gets a new rear mount gas tank. Come watch me install it. Perfect. So we can get started by taking off the bed. Uh, there's six bolts that hold the bed to the frame. And also uh, there's lights, wiring that you have to disconnect, and then the filler neck. Uh, once you get those, you should be able to lift the bed off. Um, I like to take off the bumper just so there's less things uh, to, to interfere when taking off the bed, but you don't have to. But if you want to save that paint, eh, might be a good idea. So here's some of the hackery that I did when I first put in the LS motor. Uh, I never put any kind of fittings onto the uh, steel braided lines. Here, take it out. My C10, it had a brace in the middle of the, where I wanted to put the gas tank. So I won't be able to, I had to take that brace out. Uh, if you're ever taking out rivets on these C10s, um, the best way I've found to do it, grinder, X the heads, and then just either use a chisel, and then uh, like a sharp chisel, and then pop off those heads. have to remove the bracket that holds on the uh, brake line so you'll have to move that and re relocate it uh, let's see what else the way I have my uh, exhaust ran it's gonna interfere with the gas tank so right here I'm gonna have to just I'm gonna go ahead and chop it over there and then create some dumps dump out that uh, exhaust before the axle instead of after the axle like I had it. Um, I don't know how much big of a difference that's going to be, but we'll see. Uh, the gas tank won't fit. The gas tank is going to sit up here, so it'll be in the way with these here. All right, let's keep working. Now to the next problem. These, uh, this tank, for whatever reason, it didn't, the tabs aren't long enough. Let's get down and see if I can. So there is barely enough room. There is barely enough room to, to mount this tank.
Um, we've got found a problem with the uh, fuel pump unit. Uh, it was leaking out of uh, these fittings at the bottom. I went ahead and ordered another one, and hopefully that solves a problem with the uh, with it leaking. All right. Uh, installed on the next video I'm gonna be doing uh, finishing up uh, I didn't want to break these into two videos but it was just so much I don't like to make these videos very long um, so come back for that one we're gonna be doing the exhaust brake line and uh, the filler neck in the bed put it all back together and this is a project done all right stay tuned